play Walk on Water by Eminem and Beyonce. We're in standard tuning. There's no capo. I'll be teaching you the chorus and the verse, the chord progressions for both of those. I'm going to start out here by teaching you the chords. So if you already know these chords, go ahead and skip ahead in the video. We have a C, a B flat major, an A minor, an F, a G, and a D minor. This one bar chord you don't need to play, so I'll show you a way to play without it, but if you are experienced enough, it sounds good if you add it in there. So, we're going to start out with a C chord. Index is on the first fret of the B string, middle is on the second fret of the D, ring finger is on the third fret of the A. Play five strings down, that's your C chord. In A minor, you just tuck that ring finger in onto the second fret of the G. There's your A minor. For a G chord, you're going to drop that middle finger to the second fret of the G. Ring finger goes all the way up to the third fret of the A string. Pinky goes right under on the third fret of the D. There's your open F chord. For a G chord, your ring finger is on the third fret of the high E. Middle finger is on the third fret of the low E. Index is on the second fret of the A string. There's your G chord. For a D minor, your index is on the first fret of the high E. Middle fingers on the second fret of the G, ring fingers on the third fret of the B. You play the D, G, the B, and the E strings. So those are the chords. We're going to start out here with the chorus because that's how the uh, song starts, and we're going to start on a C chord. So this is the way I was playing it. It goes C, B flat, A minor, and you hold it. Then it goes to an F and it finishes on a G. <clears throat> so, uh, we're starting on our C chord, going to our B flat, A minor, to the F, and then to the G. If you can't play that B flat, you can stay on the C for two measures, or, or two bars there, so you go C, two, three, four, A minor, two, three, four, F, two, three, four, G. But with the B flat in there, it sounds like this. One, two, three, four. 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 And if you'd like to embellish that, you can go, you can pick your C chord. So I'm just picking the A, the B, and the G. And then you can pick that B again. B flat, A minor, F, G, C, B flat, A minor, F, G. And if you just want to do basic strumming like we were doing, it's just C. If you can't play the B flat, just C, two, three, four, A minor, two, three, four, F, two, three, four, G, two, three, four. And it's as simple as that. So that's the chorus. And then it jumps into the verse, and the verse sounds like this. A minor to start out here, and what I'm doing is I'm picking the A, the G, and the B string, and then I'm picking the B, B, G, B, B, G, B, B, G, B, B, G, okay, so A minor, B, B, G, B, B, G, B, B, G, B, B, G, then we go to our F, you're going to pick the A, the B strings, same pattern, do that twice, then go to your C chord, and do that four times, and C, and you're going to go to your A minor, do it four times, back to your F for twice, C for twice, go to a D minor and you're gonna pick the D in the E string high E and now you're picking the E E B E E B you 
that four times. To your F. To the G, and then you finish on that. And you go right back into the verse. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and play the whole verse for you so you can hear that. So at full speed, it sounds like this. A minor. To your F. To your C. A minor. To your F. C. Here comes that D minor. for four, F for two, G for two, and it goes right back into that verse. And that's it. So I taught you the verse and the chorus. I went through that very quickly. So if you have questions, go ahead and comment below. If you'd like to see more tutorials, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.